Hello everyone, <clears throat> welcome to part 5. So now we're going to um, list out all of these tracks that we got from scraping SoundCloud. So we're going to need, actually let's get rid of this for our debugging and let's also get rid of this print statement. We're going to need to create two new lists. One is for the track links, similar to the genre links. And a new one is going to be for the track names, so that we can print them out later, or just store them. So, now we need to make a loop similar to the one we made for the genres. So we're going to say for index, comma, track, and enumerate tracks. Track links dot append and we're going to say track dot a because you see there's an a tag stored within this h2 tag so we need to get the h ref from that a tag so we're going to say track dot a dot get h ref remember up here we got we just said get to get the href because we were inside of an H a tag, but now we're inside of an h2, so we need to go one level down into the a, and then we can get the href attribute for our links. And we're going to append to the names, track names dot append track dot text, which is simply what you would see on a normal web page, just like everything with it inside of the h2 tag that appears as text. And then let's print it out. So we're going to print a string of the index. And we're also going to print this colon again plus the track.txt. And this is going to print them out from like 0 to 49. We probably want to print them out as 1 through 50. Let's just say index plus one. All right, so now let's just make some space between each track. All right, cool, so let's test it out. Four, and then let's do eleven for dubstep. Track links is not defined. Line ninety six. Let's check it out. Oh, we gotta change this to track links on line ninety two. Then we'll save it and run it again. Select four. Select ten for drum and bass. And there we go, it printed out all of those tracks, the top fifty ranked from one through fifty. So the next step is just playing this inside of the web browser. Alright, so next thing we need to do is make the let's call it the song selection loop. We gotta find out which song the user wants to play. We'll say while well, true, choice equals input, your choice, or they can exit out to reselect a new genre. And make a little bit of space. And if they chose X, then like before, we just need to break. Let's go back to the last loop. Else, we need to convert that choice back to an integer. But as you remember, 
its index plus one up here, meaning it's going to appear one greater than we need in order to use it for an index. So we're going to say choice equals int choice. That's going to convert the choice to an integer. Then we're going to just going to subtract one from it. And then it's going to play. So we're just going to say now playing plus track names choice. So that gets the name of the track at the choice index. And make some space. And then we need to open up the URL. And the good thing about the Selenium browser is it automatically plays whatever is at that URL. And normally in Google Chrome it won't. So go to track links at the choice index. And that should be it. Let me just fix the spacing here. Need to actually do a few more things before we continue on. So go up here to after soup, right after if choice equals four. And we're going to say, we're going to print out genres available. And we're mainly doing this because I forgot to add another loop in here so that we can go back to the genres after we're done selecting our songs. So come up here and say while true, put a colon, and then select everything up until here, and just click tab to make an indent. And we're also going to need choice five, which is not very and similar to this one. So come down here, only need one indent. And we're gonna say if choice equals five, we're gonna get the new and hot tracks for a genre. And the only thing we need to change is this top URL to say new URL. So now let's save it and run it. And this should be our final product here. I'm going to link to all the um, libraries and docs that will be useful if you want to expand on this. Okay, so let's try four for top tracks. Prints out all the genres. Let's try ten for drum and bass. There we go, we get the top 50 songs. Let's try 45, it should be this song here. All right, let's see. That worked. Let's try another one, 43. Okay. And now let's go press X to go back to the genre list and press X again to go back to the main menu. And now we can test out new and hot tracks. Let's try 19 for metal. For the 50 new and hot tracks. Now let's try and select 47 for this song Fate by Dom Bood. Alright, that seems like it worked, so yeah, that's it guys, I hope you enjoyed this tutorial series, and I hope you learned something, um, please leave a comment, like, and subscribe, thank you for watching, and have a great day.